Hey everyone, so we finally got it, The Sims 4 Seasons. I know this is the one I think you guys have most requested, at least that I've seen the most commented about getting seasons in. And I'm really excited about it too, It's I've been waiting for it. Um, I'll tell you guys a little bit of my reactions here. Um, I also have the slowed down version of the trailer right after this, so you can take a little bit more slowed down version, but lots of decorations, figure skating, um, new objects. I believe there's new career, which is gardener. You could do beekeeping. Look at this, look at this, so precious. Wow, decorating the tree, I can't believe it. Um, <laughs> new Year's celebration. I like that one. I wish The Sims would also add funerals, but here's Thanksgiving, Easter Bunny. There's like, there's Father Christmas or Santa Claus or whoever. And um, that guy's like making out with bees, but I, I like seasons in The Sims. I really do enjoy it. It just adds a little something. I like the weather. I like weather in any game, really. So I, I like hearing the rain. I like seeing the snow. It just adds a little something. The trailer got a little weird for me right here. This like guy gets superpowers. That was a little weird for me. It was just, I felt like, it, oh my God, that's so random. I think my biggest issue so far, just what we've seen as the trailer, uh, the snow looks like flat. Like there's not much depth to it. Um, you'll see some footprints in the snow, but only around like objects that people are interacting with. So there was, I think they're building like a snowman. Uh, towards the middle of the trailer and you can just see like the foot you see footprints in the snow but again it's still very flat and I know that was like the infamous ball pit uh that everyone sort of made fun of that was very like flat looking kind of similar in this like you'll see there's no like footprints in the snow uh when they're walking through it or when he was shoveling there and you'll see like it's only when there's like it's around an object so that's a little like, I don't know. I like good snow in video games. Like God of War, oh my God, just had such good snow. Um, Battlefront, Battlefield, those always have like amazing snow. And yes, comparing The Sims to those games is like, whoa, watch out because those are like, they have great graphics. Whereas The Sims is a little bit more casual community. So they try to make it playable on more uh, systems, in my opinion. I would assume that's why they do it. Uh, it makes the most sense. But yeah, it just looks like so many fun little activities and I appreciate that. You know, my Sims need things to do. You know, I, I know that like Sims 3, I had my most fun once so many of the expansion packs were already out. And so I feel like it's the same thing with the Sims 4 and this is one so many of us have been waiting for. But I wanna hear what you guys have to say in the comment section. Also, I know I haven't uploaded in a while, but it's because I, I didn't want to play anything until Detroit Become Human. I've been waiting for that game for so long. Um, wow, the food looks delicious. It's kind of making me hungry. That's not. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I, I'm going to have be uploading that like all for a while until I have the full game uploaded. Um, Beyond Two Souls is like probably one of my most successful Let's plays. I'm not saying that's gonna happen with this one or anything, but it was. It's th these are games I love and really lo like. So I'll be uploading that a whole bunch, so you can expect it. Also, be streaming it on my Facebook page tonight, 11 p.m. Central, and throughout the week. But yeah, I will be covering this expansion pack. I'm not going to EA Play. I just didn't want to go. Um, I still. I, they sent me an application to be a game changer a while ago, and I just sort of ignored it for like months now and now I feel weird about it. I'm happy to just kind of review The Sims games as they come out um, and be able to say like whatever I want to say without really feeling that bad about it. Yeah, this is so, it's just odd. I, the Sims does have supernatural stuff from time to time, but I was just so thrown off. I just didn't expect it in like a seasons thing. I like, when I was like, when I was editing the video before I even watched it, I was just like, skipping through and I thought someone got struck by lightning, but that was like not what this was. Like I'm pretty sure maybe you can still get struck by lightning. I hope so. It's the little things that matter, like getting hit by a meteor or a plane or getting struck by lightning or falling into a gigantic sinkhole. I, I like those things in The Sims. Like it always throws you off when your Sim just randomly dies. So yeah, let me know what you guys think about The Sims 4 seasons, what you're looking forward to, if you're still not really impressed, let me know. 
I want to hear everything you guys have to say. Um, but yeah, that's that's a Sims 4 update, which we need because I don't know. I feel like, you know, everybody has been waiting for something a little more. And now we got it. But yeah, guys, have a great night. Bye. And yeah, I'll have Beyond uh, or Beyond Two Souls. Wow. Detroit Become Human. I'll have the first part of that uh, tomorrow. Probably the second part, third part, maybe two as well. I'll get a bunch of it uploaded. And yeah, I don't know. I'm just going to be up all night doing that. So see you guys later.